The difference between a world championship winning Formula One car like this Mercedes here and a back of the grid car is the quality of its aerodynamics. It's the journey the air takes from the front to the rear and how it channels that air. Paddy Lowe here, the technical boss at Mercedes, is going to describe that journey. Well, we start with the front wing. Front wing generates around 30% of the downforce in the car, but more importantly, it conditions the airflow as it progresses down the length of the car. Then we have the front suspension. Very important that the front suspension doesn't spoil that airflow. And then we're into the floor. So this is what's called the bib, very front part of the floor. And here, the leading edge. A lot of components here which are all engineered to try and get the maximum energy of air underneath the floor where we generate a huge suction. Up to 40% of the downforce in the car is generated there. And then we have the rear wing. That's more of a pure device, a bit like the, the wing you would see on an aircraft, generating around 30% of the downforce. And this is the diffuser where the air finally exits at the end of its journey down the car.